Why'd that vibrate? Storage, so I just... <laughs> yeah, you just put a little, like... I don't know. <laughs> yeah, right? And then you... Just... Hey guys, it's me again. We're joined by Caleb today, and this is Dan, Dan, and Stan. And we're reviewing. Hello. Moe's. We went to Moe's Southwest Grill. Oh. Unless we're not allowed to say name brands, we went to a Mexican Burrito. restaurant. We went to a Southwest Grill. Okay, so on mine, I got brown rice, pinto beans, chicken, some pico, shredded cheese, guac, and sour cream. I usually say sour cream and guac. Mm -hmm. um, and then I got the Southwest vinaigrette. I've never had it before. Caleb got chicken, rice, and beans. I got chicken, brown rice, Sour cream, pico, um, chipotle ranch, cheese, sour, I already said sour cream, yeah. and cherry vanilla coke. Also, this is my third burrito of the week. My burrito is literally bursting. And it was. We recently, me and Sydney, have been to <sighs> Chipotle, Cordoba. Yeah. Okay, and Moe's. So we're qualified. Because we've yeah. had them both well, all multiple times, but we've all had. We, um, yeah, come on. We've also had them all recently. Yeah, like within a week and a half. But. So. I mean, is what it is. The main problem with Chipotle there's always bones in my chicken. No and you joke. put like the whole thing of guac on it. That's a good thing. Shut up. What, is, what about sour cream? Caleb, you literally got nothing on your burrito. You are not qualified. You're just gonna sit in the back and eat your burrito while we review. So, they do not have different dressings you could put on top of your burrito. And that's what we like about Moe's is you can get like the Chipotle Ranch dressing. You can get the South Foot Vinaigrette. You can get other stuff. And then, Cadoba. I mean, you can get queso, which I tried for the first time last time we went. It was pretty good. It was a little spicy too, which I like. I like it spicy. Um, but th the main problem with um, Cordoba is the how little guac they give. Yeah. And it's disrespectful for the most part. So, in my opinion, the ranking is like Cordoba. Chipotle and Moe's. This kind of tastes like bad. What about Taco Bell? This way? We went to this place one time. Pancheros. Pancheros. Um, and they like smash your burrito. They like mix everything up, so that's actually kind of nice because, like, sometimes you get a burrito, it's like you just get a mouthful of just like one thing. Okay. So there they mix it. But when I was eating it, the burrito fell apart. Oh. That place we don't really rate because of reasons. No. So. Yeah, Moe's is definitely top game though. Mm -hmm. I feel like Moe's is the most reasonably priced. And you always gotta get cherry vanilla coke. But the one thing, they either have it or they won't have it for months. And then I gotta mix the cherry and the vanilla. It's not evenly proportioned. And sometimes, Dan has witnessed it, they run out wow. of one of them while I'm pouring it. Yeah. So that it's more vanilla-y or more cherry-y. But... They just need to step up their game with that. Yeah. Uh, I don't know if you guys can see again, but like right here is guacamole. And right here is rice. Ugh. So like I'm a little bummed that it's not more mixed, but is what it is. Moe's, if you want to sponsor us, 
or any burrito place if you want to sponsor us. Even if we rated you last, <laughs> we still like you. We still like you. Except for Panchero, sorry. But I mean, like, if you want. I just ate a bean in my burrito. It stopped recording. <gasps> I almost threw up a little bit. But I breathe, I breathe in when I bite. Why didn't he just... What? Never mind, Caleb. What? Just go throw it out. What? <laughs> just go throw it out. What's wrong? Go throw it out! Fire out! Uh, I was gonna say, why didn't he just wait for us to all be done? He's special. No. Look at him run, look at him run, look at him go. What a car code. It's temporary. So, Tomatillo salsa review, the green one, not Southwest Tomatillo. Um, it tasted like battery acid, which it normally doesn't, so. How do you know what battery acid tastes like? That's what I was gonna say. Well, I don't, that's what I imagined it would taste like. <laughs> well, I mean. I don't know, anybody, if you've survived trying battery acid, comment down below. <laughs> I don't love Chipotle. Chipotle not my life. I like it. I don't love it. Moe's though. That's my heart. Uh. Uh, I don't like how slippery it gets. That's what she said. <laughs> ah! Ah! Blade. You put the tortilla down, you put the brown rice in, you put the chicken on, and you shake it all around. You put some sour cream and a little shredded cheese and salsa to top it off. And guac. Please yeah. sponsor us, we will make a jingle for you. Yeah, like let's we'll make a commercial for you. Yeah, we're funny, we're relatable, people like us. We like us. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna try my salsa. I forget what it's called. Uh, uh. Oh, El Guapo, like me. <laughs> Did you get the harsh one? Thanks for watching. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up. Watch our other ones. Share it with all your friends or family or your Homeless dog. Homeless man on the street. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. Don't do that. I keep Unless. thinking every car is gonna hit us. I know. They're like, yeah. <laughs>